Marhaba everyone, and happy May Carnival. I've got a special challenge for you today, coming to you straight from Morocco. What does tea have to do with it? Well, actually, everything. In Morocco, when you have guests, you always serve tea. Moroccan tea, pate, is made with green tea leaves, fresh mint, and lots of sugar. When you pour ate, you slowly raise the teapot, making a longer and longer stream. Why would you do that? Well, pouring from up high makes sure the ingredients will mix, and the air cools down the ate so that you can drink it faster. Better, right? It also makes foam, kashkusha. And as one Moroccan friend says, more bubbles, more love. So for this challenge, we'll need three things. A teapot full of cold tear water, you don't want to burn yourself, a glass, and a safe place to pour. We're going to be splattering, so maybe you do this outside. And I've invited some friends to do the challenge with us, so let's see who has the tallest pour and the most kashkusha. This video was sent by my friend Khalil from a cafe in Fez, Morocco. So we can see how you pour tea the Moroccan way. That looks great. Bsaha. Bon appetit. Ate Gribi Khdar Moroccan green tea. It's very hot. I'll start off by pouring the first cup. However, this cup is not to drink, it's just to pour back into the pot or the brad as we call it to help cool it off. Now, I'm ready for a real pour. Ideally, a real pour should not involve me spilling it all over the table, but you get the idea. Trick shot. Mostly in there. Bsaha. 